hi guys so a fellow subscriber of mine asked me to do an editing tutorial so here you go so take a picture of your OC in your like chosen background it took me a while to find it so yeah take a picture get your OC this picture wasn't right because I forgot to delete the eyebrows this is important yeah, delete the eyebrows because you're going to be adding them on on the editing, on the edit. But, like, this is optional. You don't really have to do it. Oh, the reset all button. So annoying. So, yeah, just get it in. Uh, you're, like, the pose that you want. Yeah. Sorry for this horrible voiceover. So, yeah, just take the screenshot and go into your editing app. I use IBS Paint X. And I used to not, like, edit at all. And now I edit quite a bit. Um, so yeah, all my edits are here. That I've done. So click the, like, import picture button and do the all photos. And click your screenshot. Don't click extract line drawing. I don't recommend doing that. So what I always do, I get the airbrush normal and get a black color and just, like, shade like a frame, I guess you could say. Yeah, so do that. Just uh, be careful with it. Don't like make it too dark because you need to keep it like blended in with the uh, background. So you're gonna, we're gonna have a few um, normal layers here, uh, like for the eyebrows, blush, and stuff. Sorry for the background noise. So this is me doing the eyebrows. Uh, get the felt tip pen hard and do what I'm doing on the screen. And get the color of your hair and turn it into a darker version. I got gray for her. This took me a few tries because I, like, usually they're uneven lengths. And I try to get them pretty even. And if you're not happy with the position of them, you can always just lasso them. And then, like, go out of it to save it. So you'll see me doing that. Sorry for the heavy breathing. This is my first time doing a voiceover. So, yeah. this um, So they were, like, uneven, like, in that way. Like, so I just made that lower. Yeah. And I only have that excessive touch thing because sometimes... Yeah, sorry about this ad. I, I was pretty ticked off when I was recording this and this happened. So how are you all today? Tell me how you are in the comments. I hope you all are doing very well. So yeah, um, I forget the name of the person. Oh yeah, they don't really have a name, but um, someone commented on one of my posts. They asked for a editing tutorial. Well, I offered them an editing tutorial. I said I would do one. So, here you go. So, go back into that. Yeah, we're going to have to wait. So, yeah, now we are going to oh uh, yeah I usually do I chop the eyebrows a little bit this is optional I usually just do a few little cuts so now uh, yeah you just get a, a pen make sure it's not uh, thick it has to be quite skinny and do like some texture lines I only do this for black clothing i i recommend it for doing for black clothing not really any other colors so another normal layer i'll be doing the blush blush how i do blush is also optional so get your airbrush normal and get a dark red color because we're, we're not doing this in multiply and you get this um like, do a lighter red for lighter skinned people and darker for darker skinned. Yeah, so it looks like that. Looking absolutely beautiful, girly. So, 
make sure you have full capacity. I uh, keep full capacity on for most of this. So, I think, yeah, so get a multiply layer and clear out. Right, so go. Yeah, you might. This is optional too, but I wanted to do it. So, I, I noticed that there was like the red in the in the pupil and the eye so I wanted to clean that up yeah so if you'll see me cleaning it up um yeah this is also optional too but I wanted to do it so it looked better and the blur tool literally solves all her problems so I just blurred it if I accidentally erase something I wasn't supposed to because not all of us are pro at erasing I don't know how many times I've clicked that undo button. Uh, uh, yeah, so, yeah, just do that until you're happy with it. Yeah, so just save that. So go into the brush and, well, no, sorry, not the brush, the magic wand and magic wand all of your eye. Um, make sure that you get the pupil in there too, because it will look weird. Uh, literally the whole entire eye, not the eyelashes, just like the eye. Uh, no special gap recognition or anything. So get the, make sure this is on full capacity. I didn't notice that it was not on full capacity and I was just fooling around at this part. So get like a purple color. This is too magenta-y and I only realized that later on. Um, so just like get a more purpley color. You'll see me get a more purpley color in, um, later. So yeah, I noticed that this color was like weird looking. I didn't like it. And I also noticed that I made a mistake, because we all make mistakes. So, then I noticed that I erased literally everything on that layer, so I did undo, because why? We need all that. Um, I, I noticed that I didn't put the... Like purple in the multi in the multiply layer. That's okay. People make mistakes. Um, I uh, was too lazy to go back and fix that mistake that I did there. Um, with the eraser, so I just used the blur tool because the blur tool fixes all of our problems. Oh yeah, so here I'm getting a purple color. So, yeah, the purple color. You're going to put it at the top of the eye. Don't make it a thick, like, layer. Um, do the, yeah, just, my screen is froze right now. So, just watch what I'm doing on the screen. I'm sorry, it is lagging so badly. So yeah, just do like a thin layer of that, not too, too thick, like, because you need to keep a little bit of room for the, for like the add layer for the lighting and the eye, which is also important. So what am I doing here? Hold on one second. Okay guys, I'm back. Um, I was just checking up with some things and I watched the recording over. So, uh, here I am doing, like I'm doing the light in the eye. So all you're going to do is, um, magic wand, the pupil, and like the bottom part of the eye and get some, get a brush and lighten, I guess you could say. Like, um, 
Yeah, take your airbrush normal and get the color of your eye and go into an add layer to do that. Um, I already explained that and literally, oh, no, I'm doing that in what you're seeing now, so just remember what I said. So, magic wand the lower part of the eye and get the airbrush normal and get the color of your eye. If it's white, just leave it white and just, yeah, put like, yeah, just put a little bit of it on the bottom of the eye and blur it. But if you're doing a, like, a color that's not white, just get, and it can't be black. Um, so you can get the, a lighter color of the eye, just a slightly lighter color, and keep doing that multiple times. So, now I'm just going to talk about some stuff, because you're going to just, uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure you guys are smart, so you can follow along to what I'm doing on screen. So, I'm going back to school next week, because my mom wanted to keep me home for COVID reasons and stuff. So, I'll be going to school next week. So, you guys, um, my time zone is uh, pretty much different than most of yours, because I live in Canada. So, yeah. So, you guys won't be getting videos in the morning, like when I get home from school. I'll go right up in my room, start editing for you guys, because I love all of you so much. And I'm growing really fast, and that's making me so happy. And we are, we have a family here. And I am all of your mother. I own you all now. You are officially mine. So, yeah. I'm sorry about the voiceover. As I've said multiple times, I'm new to, do, to doing voiceovers. This is actually my first voiceover. Uh, yeah, I've never done one before. So, yeah, um, at first I, like, really sucked at editing. Only no new basic skills. Like, I knew how to, like, shoot the background. That's it. Like, my edits, my edits were really, really bad. Um, and then I watched a few tutorials, I did them step by step, and then I just per progressed from then. I, the first vi video that I ever, like, edited was my Black Beach meme. You can go check that out. It's one of my older videos from, like, a two or one month ago. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching.